Good evening everybody. Thank you very much for joining in. This side Rahul Magan here talking on behalf of Treasury Consulting LLP as a Chief Executive Officer. And today we are going to speak about very very interesting topic that has happened recently not more than two days ago. That is 100, that is sorry, that is 35 billion penny stock scam by Neuromama. Neuromama which is an American company. Now we heard about a lot of scams that has happened recently. There every second day if you open the newspaper there are a lot of scams which are happening and in fact you might have noticing that why body is so much blank because we need so much space for that. There are a lot of scams which are happening across the globe. This company did this, this company did this, this company is not meeting this criteria and so on and so forth. Security and Exchange Commission is behind this company. RBS cancelled the contract with Infosys. RBS is face facing that much query. UBS paid so much amount of fine for the for the interest rate rigging. Barclays in this and so on and so forth. Now we are going to speak about this penny stock scam. Now let me read something very interesting for you. And again we are taking an indemnification because we are taking the data from Bloomberg. Now, New Mama Limited might be the most prominent example, but it is unlikely to be the only one. Exactly. Now, on Monday, Securities and Exchange Commission halted its share, which trade on over-the-counter markets in U.S. and over and uh, in the U.S. over potentially manipulative transactions and concerns about identify of the person in control. Excellent. There were the red flags over the years, but New Mama, which has ambitious to license heavy iron and fusing technology patents among its many projects began to draw more scrutiny this year after paper value more than quad upper to 35 billion dollars card volume now this penny stock is also known as card volume you mean to say you have so many shares and you have so much market capitalization can that be possible but reverse sometimes is possible, which is you have so much shares and you have so much market capitalization. This may possible, but this something which is not possible. I'll read more for you. How can an officer search engine who not reported financials in 2013 was able to become a multi-billion dollar company is a is an all familiar tale in the murky largely unregulated otc market filled with a penny stock that don't even meet listing requirement of new york stock exchange as well as nasdaq it has long been a long grip for exploration by fraudster who manipulate shares of the shell companies to make illegal profits through pump and dump scheme when then halted neuromama this week security and exchange commission cited false statement from the company that it had applied on the list on the nasdaq now the very very important talk in the last several years security and exchange commission has created an operation which they referred as a shell expel under this they themselves uh, acknowledge that it is very easy to create a shell companies in us than anywhere and shell companies has never been a problem for decades because agency has lacked the resource to police them and in this shell expel shell, shell expel shell expel operation more than 800 such companies over the last few years in an operation uh, got identified. Several like Neuromama has reported little or no sale. Also, it has a multi-billion dollar company. This is an exact copy of an Indian scandal that has happened which is Rico India. Where in one company who not even reported rupees 1 of capex but increases the loan amount by 1000 crore that is excellent nothing else but excellent so you meant to say you have an amount you not increase the capex by one rupee but you increase the loan amount by one by 1000 crore now with this video like several companies like neuromama who is in us created so many shell companies sec himself clearly said that there are more under more than 800 shell companies that got identified how many shell companies we have in India? Wherein the, their volume is scant, but the market capitalization is in billions. How many shell companies? I'll read more for you. As in US, it is fairly easy for the people to incorporate shell companies and get them and trading in OTC market. Contrast that to companies with ambitious to list on the New York or NASDAQ, 
which often entails years of planning and billions of dollars in legal expenses not to mention have an actual business which is not the case with neuromama like neuromama several other all over the credit over the counter listed companies have reported little or no sales yet they are billions in the in the market value aj green tech holdings limited which say that it had a green energy company it's valued at 5.3 billion trhf corporation say it is a provider of the platform providing relax and replenishing life in beautiful ecological countryside as 5.1 billion dollar of the market capitalization and there are many such companies which are reported that according to security and exchange commission more than 800 such companies are identified and more are on the way not sure how many are neuromama now the biggest question is how many neuromama we have in india 1 2 3 4 10 20 100 what would happen if several years down the line we will get to know that india is having more than 30 shell companies say india is having more than 30 shell companies who have collectively 150 billion dollars of market capitalization why the regulators in india are not understanding that there are several neuro mama exist in india as well and we also understand that if we go in the equity derivative market then there is a lot of trading which is happening in penny stocks then in the regulated stock because the regulated stock would increase by 1 rupee 2 rupee 3 rupee on the other hand if you buy a penny stock in 5 rupee it would increase to 10 rupee which is exactly 100% of the margin so with this video the purpose of the tragedy consulting llp and also of the mine is to make you aware that like the neuromama there are many other companies which are in the place and we don't know how these companies would react there could be several companies in india and different parts of the globe so please be careful while doing penny trading you are welcome to connect us at tragedy consulting llp at the rate gmail.com our alternate email id is rahulmogan8 at the rate gmail.com our mobile number is 9898242978 and id is skyprahul327 5327 thank you very much and hope to see you soon thank you and have a great day